Hey gang, happy Monday. We made it. Um, so for those of you that came to homecoming on Saturday night, I hope that you have recovered. Um, I find the older I get, the longer it takes me to recover, but it was a blast. Um, thank you to everyone who came out. You guys are the ones that made it an awesome night. Uh, we danced, we laughed, we gave awesome awards. My heart was full. You guys are wonderful. Lots and lots of gratitude. Um, so with that, we're going to use that sense of gratitude to roll into what we have coming up next. So like we talked about at homecoming, we are extremely lucky, right? Sometimes we get caught up in the tiny little bullshit first world problems that we have. But if we stop and look around and see, and we saw that on Saturday night, like we have surrounded ourselves with such amazing people, a diverse group of people where we can all come together and support each other. And we live a life that allows us to come experience the gym on a regular basis. Um, that's a pretty amazing life and not everybody has that life. And so we're going to take some time to give back to those that don't have the ability to have an amazing life like we do. So every year we do a charity event and our charity event is called going the distance, not just going the distance for the machine that we're going to talk about right now. Um, but also going that further distance to help others, right? Because we are so grateful for living a wonderful life. We're going to pay it forward to others that um, could really use our help. So our going the distance event is time for us to raise money for a wonderful charity. Now, each year we do a different charity. This year we're raising money for Camp Fatima. Camp Fatima is an awesome summer camp for children and young adults with special needs. Um, this is a camp that is very close to Coach Courtney's heart. Um, she's going to speak more on it later, um, but she volunteers her time every summer at this camp. This camp is completely free for these children and young adults. And these are individuals who other camps don't have the resources to uh, take on. And so Camp Fadma is one that is free for all the campers, uh, runs solely on donations, and all of the counselors and support and resource teams are volunteers. So we're going to raise money for that camp and those children. And we're going to do so through a fun event. We um, are going to do a marathon row. It can also be a ski or it can be a bike. We have equivalent um, mileage in bike. So the way that this works is you're gonna gather your team. You can have a team of three to four people and you get one machine. You can sign up to be a row team, a ski team, or a bike team. The day of the event, which is going to be October 21st, it is a Saturday. It's gonna be from eight to 12 that morning. So between now and the 21st, you're gonna gather your team, three to four people, and you guys are gonna to prepare to row, ski, or bike equivalent of a marathon. So how long does that really take? Well, a marathon row typically takes about three hours. Are you going to be rowing for three hours straight? No. The way it works for most teams is if you're on a team of four, you most teams will row or ski um, a 1K, and then you rest while your other three teammates do theirs, right? It's a relay. So you're probably gonna be on the machine for about four to four and a half minutes, and then you're gonna rest for probably about 12 minutes. So during that time, what are you doing? Well, you're having a blast with everyone else who is here, and we're having a good old time raising money for those that can really use our help. So around the gym, you are going to see these awesome uh, frames. It has our going the distance information on it. It is a team event, three to four people. It's got the info and it's got the QR code. So if you would like to participate and we would love to have you, we wanna get as many teams as we possibly can and it is a blast. You're going to gather your team. Team captain, whoever you decide that to be, is going to use the QR code or 
I'm gonna put the link in SugarWad for you as well. It's gonna bring you to our fundraising page. On that fundraising page, there are three options. One, you can sign up a team. A team is a $100 donation. That means if you have four people on the team, you're each going to be donating $25, right? Very reasonable. So that team is gonna be a $100 donation. It goes directly to Camp Fadma. Your second option is you can make a direct donation, right? Anyone can make a donation. You can send this link or QR code. We'll send it out in the email to friends, family, Facebook, Instagram, wherever you want. It is a public page where we can raise money for this camp. Okay, people can just make a straight donation. If you have your own company or you have a company that has a budget for charitable events, this might be a great opportunity for you to make a donation. Um, and all the information is on the fundraising page for you. Okay, the third option is we are doing fun raffles. So you can buy tickets and the um, cost of the tickets is a straight donation. And then the day of the event, we will pull winners for those prizes. You'll see when you go to the page, you can see it's called sweepstakes. Sweepstakes are the prizes and you can buy um, tickets, if you will, for the individual ones, right? We have some restaurants that have donated things. Um, we've had some lo local breweries donate some things. So you can see the different packages and you can buy accordingly, okay? So three ways to raise money. We can sign up a team. I hope everyone does. I want to see as many teams as possible. Second is just to make a straight donation. Third is if you would like to buy tickets to the sweepstakes or the prizes. Okay. Now, team registration, it is live now. We only have a set number of rowers, set numbers of skis, set number of bikes. So if you know that you and your team want a specific machine, you need to register ASAP because the second all the rowers are taken, the rowers are taken. The second all the skis are taken, the skis are taken, okay? And in the system, it is set up with the number of teams that it will allow for each machine, okay? So just one person from your team needs to register your team, not every individual person, because it will be one cost for a team and it's $100 per team, okay? So you're gonna see these all throughout. Now these frames at the end of the event, see how there's a little plaque on there, right? The winning team for each machine we're going to take an awesome photo of the winning team and these will be hung up in the gym and every year during this event we will have the winning team year after year after year right so this one it says going the distance team bike champions 2023 so bike teams whoever does it the fastest wins we also have one for the ski and we have one for the row so three winning teams it's a race guys let's see how much money we can raise for these awesome children that really could use our help and let's have some fun doing it, all right? So these are gonna be around the, uh, the gym. We're gonna put the QR codes and the links everywhere. If you have a company that would like to make a donation, we would love it. If you wanna post it to social media, post it to social media, you wanna send it to your friends and family, go for it. Let's see how much money we can raise, guys. I'm super excited for this, this is gonna be great. We have a couple weeks to do it. If you have questions about it, please talk to a coach, um, but let's uh, show our gratitude and uh, let's help out some awesome kids, guys. It's gonna be great. Have an awesome week.